following content is captured on PC emulating the PS5 experience. All right. Oh. You all know the target. Shiva's dominant. And only the dominant. All right, so we got some How do we even knights. Whoa. Our kind do not question the orders. We got face tattoos. Damn, man. Oh, chocobos! This is Final Fantasy, huh? Square and... Cool, a medieval Final Fantasy. That's good. Oh, there's Shiva. Dang! Dang! That guy got crushed. Alright, they're talking about crystals. <laughs> Definitely Final Fantasy. You should not be out of doors. We have discussed this. Come, Joshua. Your father will be expecting us. Interesting. It's like I am Joshua. The clothing and the style. I mean, like they're doing that thing I'm that Final sorry. Fantasy does sometimes when they go medieval. Is they add in modern elements. Wow. What do you mean you refuse? Wow. So it, sorry, they're showing fighting, and it's pretty nice actually. The character looks a little stiff at times when you're shooting the fire, but I like this. I actually might actually get this game. Um, a medieval Final Fantasy, but with the fighting, like modern day mechanics for fighting style. Like um, they're fighting like the the last Final Fantasy came out where you can throw your weapon and then like, move with it. It's like a cross between that and like Kingdom Hearts almost. Yeah. Wow, that's cool. And it's cool because you're seeing some of the classic Final Fantasy monsters in here too, which looks really nice. Whoa! Dang, man. That kid got like. Oh, dang! What is he like, the Phoenix? Oh, well, he's got some kind of firebird. Ifrit, maybe, in him? No, Ifrit's the demon. Whoa. What? That's impossible. Huh. Oh, yeah. Is that Ifrit? Is the little boy Ifrit? The legacy of the legacy crystals. Of the crystals. I mean, it's Final, it's epic, so it's definitely you know it's Final Fantasy. I mean, it looks awesome. The fighting it's weird because normally in like a lot of games nowadays they have like oh how many enemies can we put on screen at once? But the battles look really like like smaller scale, or at least that's what they're showing so far. Maybe they'll add more in later. Um, I'll kill you. Is this like? If it's the last thing I do. Oh dang! The revenge story. What if? Final Fantasy 16. Holy cow, we've had so many Final Fantasies. And that's just the main numbered series. That's not including all the spin-offs. Uh, PlayStation exclusive, obviously. Uh, sweet! That looks pretty good. That looks pretty good. Ooh, another Capcom game. That day, if our positions were switched, would our fates be different would i have your life huh. devil may cry oh devil may cry 5 special edition <laughs> okay so they're doing a, a special edition of devil may cry 5 onto the uh, ps5 okay i was like dang another devil may cry game already um Cool. That's cool. We got Virgil and uh, and Dante fighting side by side. That's cool looking. Oh, and they're in their like demon modes too. That's cool. Whoa. That's cool. He can project his demon mode. Oh, that's neat.
I never played the I played the demo of Devil May Cry 5, but I haven't played the game itself. Um, I own all the Devil May Cry's except five, and I I meant to do a marathon of the first four and the remake leading up to it. But I think we played the remake, and then that was like four. I, oh, I played some of one, um, and then I just like lost track of time as usual. But yeah, I haven't played this one, so I don't know. If, I've heard a couple good things, but only from like two or three people. I haven't watched any reviews or anything of it. But um, but I do like this universe, the Devil May Cry universe. Um, I watched the anime too, and they did a comic book at one point that I also owned. Um, I don't think I still own it though, but I did own it at one point. And then they oh they did a they did two comic books. They did like one from Dreamwave, I think, and then I think they did another one from Titan as well. All right, they're like, <laughs> they're really teasing. I, I love that they're showing off games, but I think a lot of us just <laughs> want to hear about the system now. Gregory, your friends are worried about you. They're here with me. What is this? Please come out. Someone's got bunny ears. Gregory. Gregory. I made a box of temper here, but it was just a glitch. Whoa. The demon. Robot it's been such a difficult day for all of us. Why don't you come out and we can play what a game together? Is, oh, wow. Is this a Five Nights at Freddy game? It won't happen again. I think it is. It's like a casino. It's like a giant it's just, just a casino. Gregory, be still. Gregory, be still. Oh, that's creepy. I think she's found us. What? Okay. <laughs> Five Nights at Freddy's. Security breach. It's like a giant casino that you're like looking over. And there's like different rooms with different things in it. It's like, ugh. And they showed like the kitchen and there's like a, a robot monster in there. And uh, they showed someone with like bunny ears. Like, that's pretty cool. I don't know. I've only seen the first uh, and played the first Five Nights at Freddy's. So I don't really know too much about it either. All right, from PlayStation Studios. Whoa. Soul of the Lost withdrawn from its vessel. In Japan Studio. Is Miles Morales coming for PS4 too? I don't think so, actually. I think Miles is, is just a PS5 game, I think. Um, I mean, we haven't seen that officially announced, I don't think, but... I think so that's what the case is with many. Miles. Because they want to sell these consoles. <laughs> if they want to get those consoles going, man. Um, I've, I, I, you know what I hope they reveal is a... Oh, this is that Dark Souls like original game like that they're remastering. It looks beautiful. Everyone tries, to, like, for a while, I was like, when I was on Twitch, people would try to get me to play Dark Souls. And I saw, I watched other people play, and I saw how frustrated everyone was getting, and I was like, I'm not playing that. <laughs> like, I'm not playing you, and that's just going to piss me off the whole time. It's not that I don't like a challenge, I just don't like to live stream a challenge. Uh, because I want the, the live stream to be fun, you know, and, and I can be engaging and stuff and not be frustrated. Um, I did stream a couple games on hard mode. And it was not a good time <laughs> on my streams. It was not a good time. I think we played Resident Evil 7 on the hardest mode when it came out. Like, we beat it on normal, and then we played it on, like, the hardest. And then I think... I can't remember if we unlocked one even harder. I can't remember. But anyway, we played it on the hardest mode, and I was live streaming it. And the Jack Baker fight, the second one in the in the, uh, the Swamp House, um, where he's, like, big. Um, I think that took me, like, an hour and a half to beat Jack. It's like so long. It took forever. And there was like, I think someone posted a link on Reddit. And they were like, guys, you got to check this dude out. He sucks at this game. So I had like a hundred people in there just watching me. And there were some people cheering me on. Some people saying I sucked. And it, it was, but it was fun. Like they made it fun. Because I was like, oh, if they weren't here doing this, I might be frustrated. But I was frustrated up until that point where I died so many times that I was like, I could rage quit. Or I, there was always people rooting me on and, and telling me I sucked. And I was like, well, let's 
let's try a, a few more times. And luckily, I, I ended up eating it, so. Ah, thanks for the four thumbs up. I appreciate that. Um, so yeah, you'll see my, my reaction to the Miles trailer. I'll post it later. Like, I'm going to take this footage, and then I'm going to cut out the parts where I reacted to those moments. And then uh, and add the trailer on top of it, and I'll re-upload them probably tomorrow. Um, I wanted to do some editing today, and I just was lazy. I just, so I just played Monster Hunter World today. The thing is, I worked from Thursday to, uh, to Monday, um, and I, some of those days were really long days, and one of those days on Monday was really early. I was at, there at 7 a.m., um, and I got home at around 2.30. So I was really, I was just tired all those days. So then yesterday was my first day off, and I did two live streams and um, uploaded two videos. And I was like, all right, Wednesday, I'm not doing anything. I'm just going to relax. I'll do this live stream. And then in like three hours, maybe, uh, we're going to do another live stream for, uh, for Batman. Because obviously every day I've been posting a Batman video this week. And so we're going to do one um, where I look at these Batman toys from Spin Master. These little Batman toys. I got a bunch of them. A lot. I bought them like a, a month ago. And I've just been holding on to them so I can make a video on them. So we'll do that later tonight when we talk about different Batman characters. Demon's Soul. Yeah, that's like the the Dark Souls origin or something, like remade or something. I don't know much about that universe either. Like, there's a lot of games that are coming out people are excited for. I'm like, man, I'm, like, I used to be a gamer and be up on all the gaming news, and those days are way behind me. What's up, Ferris? How's it going, bud? Oh, look at that. We were right. $4.99 for the PlayStation 5. $3.99 for the, uh, the, the digital one. Comes out November 12th uh, in Japan and other countries. Comes out on the 19th in the rest of the world. So now you know. Okay. Thank you all for joining us today and for being part of this So 500 journey. bucks. For the main system, if you want all the, you know, the, you want the drive on it to play Blu-rays and that stuff and games. If you want the digital one, it's four I gotta say, those are good prices. But I think I'm gonna go with the Xbox because I only have to pay 25 bucks for it. Let me leave you with one more quick look. All right, we got one last quick look at something he's gonna show us. All right, let's see what it is. Snow. The time draws near. No way. Is this Is this God of War? No, it is. It's probably just gonna be a teaser, right? We're not gonna see anything in the game, but they made the symbol with all the markings on it. The, like the kind of the Omega looking symbol. Oh, Ragnarok. Oh, Ragnarok is coming. Sweet. 2021. Wow, we're going to get it next year? Dang. Wow, okay. And no footage or nothing, <laughs> but still. Uh, pretty cool. Hey, all right. Good job, PlayStation. That was all right. I mean, you know, I don't know, though. I got to say... Um, for 400 bucks, like I, I don't think they mentioned a payment plan, at least not in this video. Maybe they will, because maybe because I think all this was ready to go. Obviously, it had to be ready to go. They were just waiting to air it on YouTube. Um, but uh, but now that Xbox has announced a payment plan, I wonder if to the press that PlayStation or Sony will announce a payment plan. Also, I feel like they might not though. Um, but uh, I don't know. I mean, that was pretty good. It was a good presentation for the most part. I, um, the games they showed were pretty cool. I'm excited for Resident Evil, obviously. And Final Fantasy 16, I got to say, looked really awesome. I might actually get that at launch. Um, they said it's a PS5 exclusive, though. So um, so we'll see. We'll see when I get a PS5. Because I don't. if I have to pay $400 at once, I'm not going to be able to get a new console this holiday season. Um, not that that's a big deal. I can still play the PS4 and the Xbox uh, One. Um, 
so it's not that big of a deal, but um, but if I can literally just pre-order a, an Xbox for 25 bucks and then just pay another 25 bucks when I pick it up and that's like my first two months of payments or whatever there, I'm totally down to do that. Like that's, that'd be so awesome.